Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Today, uh, I wanna, we were running a uh, kata called Sesan, that um, is a very important kata. It's universally practiced. Most martial or karate styles practice this kata, although there's many variations. And um, because what we generally focus on is katas coming from the Shurite lineage, which have very big, strong stances and long, extended techniques, it was nice, nice sometimes to also look at a style that has short, tight stances and uh, similar dynamics, but in a different expression. So, Sison starts with the basic Sanchin position. Sanchin Dachi position and position from here. There's a breath in, where you fill the course the Hara, and you build the dynamic tension in your hips, and then there's a punch and then a reset. Now, this holds a lot of power in application, and it's some great dynamics come out of it. Now, these exercises are more about dynamics than application, really, because they're about the power of the porking of the hips, but we'll show a couple of variations. Very much. So, the first one is my hands are up, and his hands are up, we're fighting, and for some reason, let's say you come in with a left jab, and I go to here, and then I grab your arm, you grab my other arm, and we're stuck in this position all of a sudden. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come to Sanchin position and pull back. So I'm Sanchin position here, you grab my arms like you were, I come here and I pull back, and then this movement here becomes very powerful because I pulled back and created a triangulation to the person on the front foot, and then exploded my power back at them. So one more time, so you punch, and you're here, and you're tied in, and one, two, right? That power of explosiveness from this position becomes very useful. The other, a couple other things this kata, this kata does a lot of really amazing things. Another one, one is once you get the frame of how you can hold yourself here, pull back and explode, is you can explode in various ways. So one of the other ones this kata likes to do is this. Let's do it as a uh, left right again. So one, two, is I'm gonna go, right, and just explode my technique. So bang, I struck with the side of my hand. So again, left right. Here, I'm striking with the side of my hand to the inside of the head, and I'm striking under the chin, and I'm striking again onto the, hand, uh, to the, to the ribs, and if that had happened, you'd be here, and then the cutter even says I can come in the side of the neck and take out the foot. And all of that is in the cutter. In this intense sequence of attacks, this cut is very, it's kind of aggressive, <laughs> it really is, but it's a brilliant cutter for that. And the final one we can point to in the kata that's really interesting and good to know is that like every goju kata, there's a side step and then a twist and coming back up into stance. And that application is, a th well, one of the applications there is a throw. And it ties into the using the frame and the snapping of the hips. But this time, in this way. So again, this position, this position, they're all goju positions, left, right, and I'm here, and I come up, and I take out a knee. And then I step across, and I twist. And that becomes a throw. So just a few things from Saison. It's a brilliant kata. If you want to see more kata application, check out more videos. If you want to come and learn something, come down to the dojo and have a free week of trial. Otherwise, thank you for watching, thank you for your help, and thank you for your time.